have our Artist of the Month, Kay Khan. Mm -hmm. And Kay's work is very, very unique. So come on in the gallery and I'll show you what she's got here. Can you explain, I mean, it's obviously fabric. Yes. It's, fabric. do you paint on it? No, it's all stitched. It's all stitched. I developed a technique um, in which I layer lots of layers of fabric and felt, and then I use it for construction. I studied ceramic sculpture and painting, so I used everything I learned. Well, that. this must be very tricky to have these kind of shapes in here. How long does a piece like this, on average? At least a month. A month. Full time. Wow, full time a piece like this. Can and this piece, the yeah. side panels, there's, you can see this tension in the shape, so it comes to a point and it goes out and in. So all those shapes are actually helping it to hold the, the form. And how long have you been doing work like this? Oh, 20 years. 20. I mean, it's evolved over the time, but I started this technique 20 years ago. Do you sketch this out? Do you, do you before you start something like this, how, what's um, the process? Sometimes I make some sketches. usually have some sketches of the form, but not very many. And if I use faces and hands and imagery like that, I definitely do sketches, but I don't sketch on the fabric. I just sketch it because sewing is so different from drawing. Sewing is more like dissecting something because you don't see all the parts at once. Is the finished piece, like the design that you have here, is this, you knew this was going to end up like this when you started the piece? Well, Pretty somewhat. Much? Not somewhat. completely, no. There's happy accidents? Or happy, <laughs> always. Yeah, always. Well, fabric, you never know exactly what's going to happen. You have an idea of what you're doing, but the fabric demands certain things that you don't expect. So, um... Yes, I don't think I completely knew every element, how it would be when I'm finished. And that takes away some of the fun. If I know everything that's going to happen, then it's pointless to make it for me. Does each Sometimes. one of these pieces, like all these pieces over here, that you have different themes going on, obviously. Yes. Um, could you explain what, what, what is this, the theme of behind this piece here? Well, I like to write. Okay. So, <laughs> so I have uh, words on here that are somewhat, somewhat about uh, the somewhat non nonsense poetry, okay. and yet or sound poetry, and yet and the words are meant to work with the images or the shape, but not exactly. It's a, a strange combination of the two things together. Polka dots build chaotic paths of order. Okay. So it's just images that came to my mind when I was working on it. In your background to to make this, were you in fashion design or no, what? ceramic sculpture? Ceramic and painting. sculpture and painting. And, and this piece, what, this, this is This piece is flicker. titled Flicker. So the words on the one side, highlights flicker and shift to hone unknown edges. I came up with the idea for this when I was uh, in Santa Fe and I found at the end of the street there's a door. You climb up a path and there's a hidden door and if you go through the door there's another street. And I, I went to this place at night. So that is what inspired this piece. So you see the figure holding the little star. Yeah. Yeah. So, um, and on the other side, The other side, another figure, different wow. words. <laughs> Beautiful. And all of, I use silk, this is all silk. Oh, okay. This one doesn't have anything with fabric in it. No structural parts, nothing That's metal, true. nothing wood, nothing, just fabric. Yeah. And, and the inside of these, uh, are these hollow or? Yes, are, they're, they're all hollow. hollow. So yes. this, this is all just series. fabric? Oh. Yes, this series. This ser series is called the Poetry of Form. So, in this series, the object is the subject. Some of my series have faces and hands and other things on there, but oh, this okay. particular series is about this shape. So you work in series of, of certain amount of, of art pieces, or do you, does it evolve and it you know when to stop? Every, and yes, and then I'm ready to move on to something else. So, up until that point, I'm still working on the same series. Until I feel I've completed what I wanted to do. Okay. Or say, even though there are no words on this, I'm still saying something. This piece, what, what, how would you interpret this piece? Well, it's this... called Volupte. So it's, all these pieces in this particular series are meant to be somewhat sensuous in shape. The colors are meant to be intense. Okay. Intense. It's more about passion and intensity and sensuality. Wow. Well, I would suggest to get the full effect that you come to 554 Canyon Road and you come check out Kay Khan's work. And it's absolutely like nothing you've ever seen. So thank you for being our Artist thank of the you. Month. Thank you.